glute bridge with a march. So setting back into that glute bridge position, we're going to build that hip extension, but we're also going to build the stabilization through your glute and your hamstring. Remember, your glute not only extends and straightens your hips, but also stabilizes your pelvis. So once you're in that glute bridge position, I want you to just make sure your core is locked in towards your pelvis as if you're crushing a soda can and your heels are down. From here, bring one knee in, hold that for a second, control that lower. So the key isn't to just move as fast as possible. And when you move in controlled, all one tempo and keep your hips high without letting them rotate or sink. Now, if that's a little too much, you can always place your hands onto the floor. Uh, just pay attention to programming though. Uh, for uh, the, the, if you may alternate some reps, you may hold, you may just do all one side, uh, but after that movement, you should really feel that in the glute. But if you don't, heels down, so lift your toes up, so stay on your heels to intensify that feeling.